the speedy outfielder speedy number 13. The, the center fielder number 13. The pitch. Swings and misses. Oh, and, and this one is Seven off and running. Swing and a miss. Oh, and as he was out front that time. Hard ground ball base knock. Good job of just putting the ball in play with two strikes. Once you get the ball by the pitcher, there's a lot of base hits up the middle, Real even ball, on ground strike. balls. So a nice job to use that Runner, big hole. And... Runner on the goal. And a foul ball. Runner at first with no outs here. Got it by him for the K. One down. There comes Cody Bellinger. Here comes the pitch. There goes the runner yeah. from first. That's in for a strike. Throw. Save. And he's down 0-2 no as he swings through it. Fights it off. You'll see another. Runner at second here. One gone. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Here's the throw to the plate. Not in time. He's safe. Still able to come through behind in the count right there. He got that front foot down, and pitch recognition was on point. Pretty impressive for an 0-2 count. Rafael Devers. The batter now as he swings and misses for strike one. And fouled off. Bellinger stands at first with one out. Caught him looking for the K. JT Real Muto steps in. And that one That's almost got him. Runner, runner, Bellinger go. goes. Fought off foul. Donaldson delivers. Swing and a miss. One, one and two. Love to see it. Power versus power right there. Swing and that ball smashed on a line. That one hops against the fence. Bellinger on his way home. Picks himself up in RBI. Got a good pitch to drive. Stayed short with his bat path to the ball and caught it out front. And he stayed long in his follow through. That's how you split the gap. And that's pretty much a double every time. Owen oh, 2 as he waves at that okay. one. I guess you throw it that hard, you can get away with locations like that right down the middle. But I still think it's a dangerous pitch. Don't want to do it again. Donaldson kicks and deals. Liner, base hit. And they hold the runner at third base as they decide not to risk the send with two away. Buck O'Neill digging in now. Here's the pitch. Runner on the go. Strike in there. No throw, safe at second. Hit softly on the ground to third. Zips it across, and the inning is over. Bottom of the first. Here's Francisco Lindor. This guy's kind of a unicorn in today's game of baseball. It seems like we're seeing fewer and fewer switch hitters, and he is elite regardless of the side of the plate he's hitting from. Yeah, he's so fun to watch as a hitter. Bats from both sides of the plate, and he's so rare in that he really makes a lot of contact batting both righty and lefty. And, you know, it takes a ton of time in the cage to maintain both of those swings. Donaldson winds and fires. Goes down looking. And now the right fielder, Buck O'Neill. In for a strike. It's 0-1. You know, but one thing about being a great switch hitter, it's so tough to keep both of your swings sharp. I mean, sometimes it can feel like a long time in between at bats against a lefty or vice versa. You can work on both swings, but there's only so much a guy can do in the batting cage. Got him looking as the fastball runs back over the inside corner. Smash to the left side. On to O'Neal. Third out. And welcome back. Second inning set to go. Now, Alex Gordon. Hammer, base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. 
Now, no waiting around right there. He was ready to swing it on the first pitch. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. He was all over that one. Just a simple ground ball the other way that had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball no travel, ball. put strike. the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Gordon on second. Marte at first with no outs. Puts a bunt down. Bare hand scoop. But no play, and the bases are loaded. Great effort on that one. Might have saved a run. Now bad and stepping in is the speedy Ellie De La Cruz. And first offering is fouled off. Well, this is a tough situation with the bases loaded, but the healthiest mindset is just try to get out one hitter at a time. O'Neill ranging back. Brings it in. And all the runners are tagging in there safely. Well, right there, he's definitely looking for more than just a sack fly with the bases loaded and nobody out, but you'll take it. Now it's up to the guys coming up behind him who pick up the rest of those runners on base. The 0-2 from Donaldson. The yeah. punch out there. Two gone now. Rafael Devers up to hit. His first at bat was a strikeout. Swing and a miss. Oh and, and it's 0 1. Hey, it's still early in this ball game, but you know, this hit bat right here could be a big foul. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And that baby's gone. So he leaves the yard to left, and they tack on three. It's 6 0. So two down, and up to the plate is JT Real Muto. Doubled his first time up. There's a strike. With how good oh, these one. offenses are, there's a lot of ball game left. Swing and a miss. Oh, and oh, two now. Kicks and fires. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. Check swing. One, no appeal. Clearly, he hasn't had it in this game, and looks like sooner than later, they're going to have to go to the bullpen. Bounce to the left side. On to Peterson, and Real Muto is out. And they're happy to just get off the field after that frame. Bottom of the inning, here's Jack Peterson. He's a left-handed batter. Who still comes up with... Good contact and a good average against left-handed pitchers. Donaldson back to work. Swings and misses. And that's strike one. All right, so you hit lefty. What makes it so hard to face a left-handed pitcher? Left-handers, they just seem to have different arm angles. So to keep that front shoulder in there and really discipline yourself can be tough sometimes. But the guys that do it well, man, I... And that should be extra bases. Now he'll turn for second. The throw in into second easily with a leadoff double. So man aboard, an outstanding hitter in Cattell Marte. And that one fouled off. That one the other way. And there's a hit. And now now it's Juan Soto. Swing and a miss. That's strike one. one. Donaldson. He's the kind of starter that a lot of pitching coaches and managers as well really appreciate. Not a guy who's going to get himself into trouble by dancing around, by walking guys. O'Neal. 
There's one. Back to first, double play. Man, that is such a tough double play to execute as a first baseman to not only field the ball and make a good throw to second with a runner in the baseline, but also to hustle back to first base and get set up to receive the return throw. That takes great footwork and an awareness of where the bag is. A lot of practice to get that one right. Misses, that is, that's and the count is one and two. Yeah, he throws strikes, ball, and strikes. you know he's got the command to be in the zone. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. To the warning track, makes the catch. Welcome back. All set for the start of the inning. Here's a. Speed threat. Grady Sizemore. The pitch. And first offering is fouled off. You know, this group of hitters really impressing me with the quality of their bats in this one. It's been fun getting a chance to see them go to work. Look at it. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. And that baby's gone. He'll circle the bases, and they add a run. It's 7-0. Always scary for a pitcher when a guy can take a fastball down the middle and hit it to the opposite field. No holes in a swing like that. And that time, that ball was hit hard. Next is the speedy first baseman, Buck O'Neill. That one hammered center field. That's back there. It's out of here. Buck O'Neill blasts one out, and they add on. It's 8 0. So, up next, Alex Gordon. Swing it a foul straight back. And here it comes. Strike two. No Big ball. time jam right there. I hate it as a hitter, but standing in center field, you can't help but chuckle a little bit. Swing and a miss. Struck him out and one away. Could tell Marte up to the plate. He swings and misses at the first pitch. 0 and 1. Phillips, in his third season, he throws a slurve, a cutter. A four-seamer, and he works in a sinker. Right-handed reliever. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. One down, base is empty. And there's a ball. ball. Popped up. Lindor pulls it down, two away. So the lineup flips over. And here is number 13. In the air right field. Buck in position. And makes the play, and that's out number three. Back here at the ballpark, and now the DH, Rafael Devers. Well, every pitcher wants run support, and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some guys. I think keeping the mindset to attack instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse, go after hitters and get quick outs. Bellinger drifts towards it. And out number one on the grab. Here's the center field. Grady Sizemore. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. And he chases that one no below ball. the zone. Swings and misses, and there's two down. And now it's Frankie Lindor. In the air, right field. 
Bellinger puts the squeeze on that one. As we go to the top of the fourth. And now the shortstop, Ellie De La Cruz. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. One away. Bellinger up to hit. One for two. He had an RBI base hit back in the first. Swung on. Popped up on the infield. Peterson makes the grab. And there's two away. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and oh, popped one. it up. Devers, now in the box, comes up empty with a swing there. And he's down 0-2 oh, as he swings through it. And that misses oh. off the outside edge. One, two. Righty to the plate. Out towards right center field. And Devers is set down. And that's the third. And welcome back. And now here is Buck O'Neill. The pitch. And a swing and a miss there. Well, these guys, as you probably noticed, haven't been shy at the plate at all. In fact, they've probably been too aggressive at times. I'm specifically talking about the first pitch. These guys are swinging more than 80% of the time, which is fine if you're scoring runs, but that hasn't been the case today. On to O'Neill. Leadoff hitter retired in the fourth. Well, maybe approaching this at bat with a bit too much determination. Sometimes you just got to let the game come to you. And it's through for a hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. There was nothing cheap about the way he got that one through the infield. That was ripped. Caught out in front and didn't get under it like he would have liked, but definitely put a good swing on it. Got him swinging. Here's Cattell Marte. Showed a really nice opposite field approach in his last at bat. 0-1. Oh, 0-1. Oh, and, and They say it went. Oh, Rutschman off of first with two away. Next offering oh, upstairs. Boog, it looks like somebody missed the swing sign. That's the first pitch this team. Now ah, that's strike three and the third out. So we take a break. Ready now for the fifth inning. And now it is JT Real Muto. And the right hander back to work. In the air on the infield. Peterson makes the grab. And there's one down. So digging in, Grady Sizemore. He's already homered in this game. That one ripped. That's back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back on the One infield. Ball, no got track. to the spot, turned around, and made a nice catch. And now two and nothing. Popped up. Marte should have it. He's got it. And that is out number three. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Juan Soto now. The pitch. And a good fastball to start him off. at strike one. They've got a potent lineup. And when you think about teams capable of rallying from this kind of deficit, one, one. they're right at the top of the list. Check swing. He held ball. up. Ball two. Picks up strikeout number seven. Here's Josh Donaldson. Over oh, one, he flat out to right. His first trip. Donaldson. That one off the mark. One and oh. And that's in for a strike. Man, this guy's got a great feel for his breaking ball today. The 1-1 one, one is fouled off. Here's a 1-2. Lined in the left center. Base hit. 
and it bangs up against the wall. Man at first, and now Jackie Robinson. Robinson. Had a good eye there. Next offering is in for a strike. Now he can't squeeze it behind the plate. And an excellent job keeping it right there. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. Quick throw back in. Lead runner holds it second with one gone. Oh, I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Timing on the swing was good. Able to shoot the ball up the middle. Didn't square it up as much as he probably would have liked, but that's a good approach paying off. And now it's even up. That to right. Bellinger drifts towards it and puts the squeeze on that. And there's two down. Back to the top of the lineup. Now up to him, Francisco Lindor. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. To first, and he beats it. Everyone's safe. All over that one right there. That's one of those you classify as just too hot to handle. Hit it on the screws, and it couldn't be fielded cleanly, no but you one can't strike. really blame the defense in that case. Strike two. Do that Going fastball two. right by him, slightly elevated. That's a confidence boost for this guy out there on the mound. See if he continues to climb the ladder. Bellinger moving under it. And that is that. Welcome back. Top of the sixth inning. Gordon. Down the third baseman, Alex third Gordon. Alex. Gordon. The pitch. And first offering is fouled off. No, this group of hitters, simply put, are producing a lot of quality swings. Just look at how the ball's coming off their bats, and tell me it's fun playing defense at this level. Swings and blasts one deep to left center. That one back there. And that baby's gone. He flexes his power with that swing, and they tack on to their lead. It's 9-0. Welcome to the game. First pitch out of the bullpen, a tough one. And you know he's just trying to get one in there for a strike. And on the other side, as a hitter, it's a great time to be aggressive and let it fly. It's not what they were looking for when they turned to him, but now he's got to find a way to reset. And now, Cattell Marte, one for two. And first offering is fouled off. You'll one. One and one. Foul ball there. One and two now. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. And now here's a speed threat. Outfielder, number 13. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Hader, in his sixth season, he features a two-seam fastball, one, one. a slider, and he works in a changeup. Cuts on it and misses. That's a strikeout. The high heat, too much on that one. Hit high in the air. There it goes. See ya. A shot to left, and they tack one on the board. It's 10-0. A good hitter gets pitch recognition early. He saw exactly where that was going to be. The challenge, not get over anxious and come out of your swing. He stayed on it and got all of it. Base is empty with two away. Here's Cody Bellinger. And that is cut on and missed. Oh, one. It's 0-1. Bellinger measures 6 feet 4 inches. That one is absolutely belted. That's back there. It's out of here. 
He sends it out of here, and they add to their lead. It's 11 0. Two outs, space is empty, and it's Rafael Devers in the box. The tag, and that's out number three, inning over.